What's up guys, so it's me King D here. Um, I came up with a, I was thinking and I was trying to see how I can really save you guys money now. Um, this is like a huge trick that everybody could benefit off of. I mean, it's really gonna make you happy to find out that you could save money and it's such a simple thing, okay? So here's what you do. Um, this is what it is, so pretty much dry cleaners love new customers, right? Because the new customer is great, we all like them new customers and maybe in any business journey you love a new customer a new client right so as a new customer some stores even promote outside of the store new customers get a certain percentage off right so new customers if you don't ask for it when you go in and if maybe the employee isn't really really you know they don't really care they're not gonna say anything unless like you know the owners are on top of them hey if a new customer you know try to hook them up try to give them a discount this isn't that we want them to come back right so as a new customer, I come in, hey, I'm a new customer, um, can I have a new customer discount right away off the top? If they say, oh, I don't know, it's just a counter person, then go ahead and ask for the owner, hey, where's the owner? You know, I want to see if I can get a new customer discount. You know, I want to try you guys out, and I want to see if I can get a discount for this being my first time, you know? And at least 85% of the stores will definitely give you a discount, a new customer discount, right? Now, it could range from anywhere from 10, 15, 20, 25% off, right? Um, which is good, right? So that's right off the top, okay? Now, um, yeah, so if I was a new customer and I'm not going to walk in there saying, oh, hey, I'm not going to come back anymore. I'm just here, one-time thing, and I'm not going to come back to your store because it's common sense. I wouldn't give you a discount right away because you're pretty much telling me you're not going to come back. You just want a discount up front, right? So don't say those things. And you don't want to say, Oh, I'm just here visiting in town and because then they're gonna say oh she's just here in town and she's just gonna come here once or he's just gonna come here once and they want a discount you know so don't do that or if you only have like one piece or two piece and the and the cleaners has reasonable prices and you don't got that much stuff you could maybe still ask for a discount but the more you have especially in the beginning it makes it a lot easier, you know, but regardless, it's still good chances, at least 80, 85% chances, you'll still get that new customer discount, right? So, another big thing, so if you're a regular dry clean user, okay, regular dry clean user, and if you're watching this, you probably do go to dry cleaners a lot, or if you plan on starting going to the dry cleaners more often, this is perfect, I'm going to help you guys out so much right now. So, as a regular customer, you're spending money at the store, right? So, what you could do if they know you and, and or you know you and you know you spend money at that cleaners you know not just because you take one piece a week you know makes you a, a good regular customer I mean like you, you spend like a little bit of money there right if you take once a month you know every month like I wouldn't consider you a regular customer like it's not but anyways if you spend a little bit more and if you know who you are you know you're like I, I use the cleaners all the time I'm going there often I spend money there okay you ask to speak with the owner Oh, it's the owner and the owner comes out or the manager or whoever's in charge. Hey, you know what? I come here all the time and um, I don't want to change stores. I love your guys' service. I really like what you guys do for me, if that's true, right? I like what you guys do for me. You guys take care of me. But sometimes I just find it a little pricey and I'm trying to save a little bit of money. Is there any way you guys could give me a discount that's a permanent discount so I don't have to worry about asking you guys when I come in? Can you guys give me a discount or something like that? Because, you know, just simply tell them, hey, I come here all the time. And I'm trying to see if I can get a permanent discount. And then if they say no, well then you tell them, hey look, the thing is I come here a lot, I spend money here, look at my history. They got a computer, there's always uh, a history of every time you've came in. Look at my history, look at how much I've spent. I come here all the time. Um, once that's done, you should look through it and it should, it should be no problem. They should easily go ahead and give you a 10, 15, 20% off depending on how, what they charge, you know, if it's not an expensive cleaners, you know, and they give you 10% off, great, you know, if they're very expensive cleaners, give you 20% off, that's good, you know, 15% off, regardless, now you got a forever discount, you know, and who doesn't want a forever discount, so you're going to save money from now until forever, as long as you keep going to that store, if you switch stores, or you're moving cities, and you're going to go into a new store, um, and you're going to start using them, wait a little bit, maybe a month, two, three months, and then tell them, hey, you know what, I've been coming here, I come here, and you know, I plan on continuing to come here, and if, as you can see, I'm a regular customer now, and I was wondering if I could have a permanent customer discount. And then, should be able to go on the computer and add in a discount every time you come in. It should um, be applied in the computer, and 
you'll save money every time you go to the dry cleaners. Now, that being said, that's great. Now you're going to save money all the time, right? Now, some dry cleaners, I mean, like I mentioned in an earlier video, I mean, some places that give coupons. So some places you get the discount either way because maybe you take a coupon, right? You use a coupon and you get in a discount and this avoids you having to take a coupon, right? So that's good. You know, some cleaners take coupons, some cleaners don't. But the ones that do, you know, what happens when you take a coupon or let's say you have a permanent discount, what the owner or manager might tell, might. You know, I'm not saying all cleaners do this. I mean, I don't want to scare anybody into thinking that cleaners, you know, are, are so bad. You know, I just want to give you guys a heads up of what can happen. I mean, I'm telling you guys, I've been around and I know what people do, you know. Um, so what happens is once you get a coupon, now they're going to upcharge you on things they normally wouldn't charge you extra for you're using a coupon so now they're gonna charge you extra so that discount they're giving you ends up being the same thing or even more you know because you brought in a coupon or you got that discount so how to avoid that happening check your receipts check your receipts ask what they're charging you and why they're charging you that and if it doesn't add up they'll knock off that extra charge of what they're doing and once you catch on to it two three times you still want to use them they'll stop doing that to you You know they're gonna be like you know what this person you know you can't be doing this stuff they won't be doing that they it makes you feel like not going there but it maybe sometimes it's just the employees or something the manager says something and it's not that it's best or it's just sometimes they do these things i'm just telling you to watch out for that stuff i mean not that all stores do it i don't want to say that you know i i mean me personally i would never do anything like that but i've seen it happen being an employee at different cleaners like they would ask me hey if they bring a coupon make sure you're charging extra you know upcharge 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 you know on the computer every dry cleaner has their upcharge sheet i mean if somebody else, another dry cleaner to see this video or some an owner or relative of a dry cleaner sees this they're not gonna like my video but it's the truth so anyways be careful but that's the way to get a permanent discount so as long as you're checking your receipts and you shouldn't have a problem with having your permanent discount forever if you're a regular dry clean user and if you're new to dry cleaners ask for new customer discounts if you're moving city state whatever you're doing and you're going to go to a new dry cleaner tell them you're a new customer to give you a discount right away no problem all right and if they don't call me i will um anyways i'm going to keep adding my videos my phone is falling i'm going to keep adding videos any questions comments um subscribe at the bottom write anything at the bottom and we'll make a new video on that all right thanks guys bye